I want to show you a quick little um, benefit of the Steady Betty while I'm doing this. I'm not prepared uh, with lighting and everything, but uh, this is a piece that uh, uh, that I'm working on, a, a little wall hanging from Carried, um, carried Away uh, Designs in Wool. So that's what I'm working on. But it is wonderful to use your Steady Betty. It grips the uh, piece so it, it's not sliding around. Now this is my big board. And um, when I lay my pieces down, the Steady Betty grips it. And I'm not chasing my piecing all around. So, And what I've done is I've, I've kind of um, used a Susan Cleveland technique where she has put um, just these little adhesive strips down and pressed all your pieces together. So when you're, uh, when you're ready to stitch them together, um, they're already uh, um, matched up and ready to go, which I'll do a lot of quilting in here, but um, just putting these uh, blocks together. So it was just really great whenever I started putting this uh, uh, sashing on and got my center here, and the Steady Betty holds it so great. So I'm not chasing it all around and it's gripping it and I just love it. I love it. And uh, it's just another benefit um, having that, uh, that grip and that foam there to hold your, your pieces. And this is kind of a, uh, um, a the, this is wool and then this is a brushed uh, cotton. And um, so it, it's just great to have that, uh, that extra grip there. So I, what I'm going to do is go ahead and and uh, I'm, I'm going to press this um, together so it'll all be ready. And um, But just to show you, I, I, it's just amazing how that Steady Betty grips everything. So I'll come back when I get it turned over and let you see all of the uh, uh, pressing that I've done and uh, and what a, a benefit it is to have that, to have that um, uh, foam there to uh, keep everything in place, and then you're not chasing your piecing all around. Makes everything nice and accurate. So, see you soon.